Hey guys, it's Dre here, and welcome back to another Call of Duty Ghost class of the video. Today's is the Vectors. So let's go ahead and jump straight into this. Now first of all, I want to say the reason why the gameplay is already at 7 kills and 2 deaths is because I accidentally forgot to hit record at the beginning of the game, and I hit record at that specific time. So let's go ahead and jump straight into this. So, the primary weapon, of course, is the Vector. It's an SMG, which means you're going to be moving at 100% base speeds, which means you will have speed on your side when moving. The attachments. Your first attachment you're going to want, or this is my opinion, is the red dot sight because I don't like the iron sights on the Vector. If you're fine with the iron sights, I would highly recommend going with extended mags. More bullets means more enemies to kill before you have to reload. Second attachment you're going to want is Muzzle Break. Now the reason why you're going to want Muzzle Break is because at medium to long ranges, SMGs in Call of Duty Ghosts actually drop in damage, which means you got to put more bullets into them to actually kill someone. With Muzzle Break, you don't have to put so many bullets into someone to kill someone at long range. Alright, let's go ahead and move on to the perks. First perk is Ready Up. This is going to give you an advantage because if you run into someone, it's going to give you a split second and or millisecond to raise your gun up faster than the enemies. Number two is sleight of hand. This, obviously, we all know what it does. It makes it so you can reload very fast and very quick. Number three, on the go. As I mentioned earlier, you're going to be running as 100% base speed, which you're going to be on the go with this class. Obviously, it's a running gun class. And you're going to want to reload without stopping and slowing yourself down. Thus, that is why on the go is there. Number four, we have quick draw. This is in case you come across an enemy and... Paired with ready up, you're able to pull up your sights faster than they are, and you're able to aim faster with quick draw than the enemy is, giving you a more precise attack than the enemy. Number five, you're going to want scavenger to obviously keep feeding this gun bullets. You know, it's going to run out of bullets, and we don't want that, so you're going to have scavenger there. And then finally, number six, which is my personal favorite out of the perk list, is ICU. Now, basically what ICU does is it allows you to recover health a lot quicker than before. So say it takes you around 15 seconds to actually recover full health. ICU basically does that in half, so it only takes around 6 seconds for actually to recover full health. This especially comes in handy when you're being shot, you run around a corner, and you'll be able to regain health quicker and then go back around the corner and shoot the enemy that was shooting at you. So that's the overall class setup. The kill streaks I was using was the attack dog, or basically the dog, Sentry gun and vulture in the gameplay, but you can use any kill streaks you want to. So that's the class setup. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.